Thanks, Doug. We've all had that last minute grocery run, needing milk, flour, even items for a whole dinner. But for some small towns, grocery stores can be limited and miles away. KOM Samantha Walker has more on one town's efforts to keep its local markets lights on. People in Erie, Kansas like to think that they're a friendly community where people often wave and say hello. And in no place is this more true than the Erie market. It feels like home having a hometown store with customers coming in, talking to them. The Erie Market is a city-owned grocery store being purchased by the city council three years ago. The decision to purchase the store was controversial, and not everyone in the town supported the choice. But the mayor of Erie, elected six months ago, says it's time to focus on the market's future, not its past. I want people to come out and take a tour of the store. Even though they've lived here all their lives, I want to show them how it's going to be from now on. Since the store was taken over by the city, it's seen many struggles. Staff had to sort through all the products, finding expired items. And one month ago, an electrical storm forced the market to throw out all their cold items. The store staff say they are working to make meaningful changes to the market to make it a valuable resource to the community. We have cleaned a lot. We do check the shelves every day to make sure there's no outdates on the shelves. And we're just friendly. I like to have a friendly place. <laughs> The mayor says revitalizing the Erie market has been a community effort. The mayor used his own money to buy store uniforms and name tags, and citizens have donated thousands of dollars to be used to purchase new product. A team of volunteers regularly comes in to help stock the shelves and keep it running. And local businesses are making efforts to purchase things such as produce to keep the market open. If we support the grocery store, then that's going to give us an opportunity to have food right here where we don't have to travel. And especially with the roads the way they are right now, construction and everything, it's all messed up around here. According to the mayor, the average customer is spending $14 a month at the store. He says that total needs to go up to $50 a month for the store to be able to break even. He says it's important the community understands the importance of having a local grocery store. Because people need the store. I mean, if you lose your store and your post office, you lose your town. And that is in history. I mean, I've studied this and looked into it. I take everything to heart. So the store in the community is my heart and I want it to be here for him. Reporting in Erie, Samantha Walker, KOAM News. Well, the mayor of Erie says that if business does not improve like they hope, the store will have to close. If it does, residents' utility bills would see a small charge added to the utility bill until the city has paid off the loan on the store.